determination of surface tension of liquid. Aim to determine the surface tension of water by capillary rise method using traveling microscope. Apparatus Capillary tube, traveling microscope, beaker containing water, cork, bent wire, retort stand. Principle Capillarity The rise and fall of a liquid in a capillary tube when a capillary tube is dipped in a liquid is called capillarity. Theory Surface Tension it is the tangential force exerted by surface of liquid per unit length. A capillary tube is dipped vertically in water. In a beaker, it raises to height h above the level in beaker and remains constant due to capillarity. If r is the radius of the tube, d is density of water and g acceleration due to gravity, then surface tension of water t. T is equal to 1 by 2 into H plus R by 3 R dg dyne per centimeters. We need a traveling microscope to perform the surface tension experiment. Traveling microscope is used to measure the lens accurately. A traveling microscope has horizontal and vertical main scales and verniers. One division on the horizontal main scale is is equal to 1 mm. Number of divisions on the horizontal vernier scale n is 10. Least count of the horizontal scale of microscope is equal to s by n is equal to 1 by 10 is equal to 0 0.1 mm is equal to 0 0.01 cm. One division on the vernier main scale s is equal to 1 mm. Number of divisions on the vertical vernier scale n is equal to 10. Least count of the vertical scale of microscope is equal to s by n is equal to 1 by 10 is equal to 0 0.1 mm is equal to 0 0.01 cm. Take a stand whose height can be adjusted. Place the capillary tube in the holder of the stand. The lens of the traveling microscope can be moved in horizontal direction by using the horizontal adjusting screw. The lens can be moved vertically by using the vertical adjusting screw. Place the capillary tube with the stand behind the microscope and adjust the position till the capillary tube bore is clearly visible from the lens. Adjust the horizontal position of the microscope lens till the vertical cross wire looks like a tangent to the circle bore on the left. Note the readings of the horizontal scale and the horizontal vernier. Main scale reading MSR is equal to 6.4 cm. Vernier coincidence VC is equal to 4. Total reading TR R1 is equal to MSR plus VC into LC is equal to 6.44 cm. Adjust the horizontal position of the microscope lens till the vertical cross wire looks like a tangent to the circular bore on the right. Note the readings of the horizontal scale and the horizontal vernier. Main scale reading MSR is equal to 6.9 cm. Vernier coincidence VC is equal to 9. Total reading TR, R2 is equal to MSR plus VC into LC is equal to 6.9 cm. Adjust the vertical position of the microscope lens till the vertical cross wire looks like a tangent to the circular bore on the bottom. Note the readings of the vertical scale and the vertical vernier. Main scale reading MSR is equal to 3.7 cm. Vernier coincidence VC is equal to 9. Total reading TR, R3 is equal to MSR plus VC into LC is equal to 3.79 cm. 
adjust the vertical position of the microscope lens till the vertical crosswire looks like a tangent to the circular bore on the top. Note the readings of the vertical scale and the vertical vernier. Main scale reading MSR is equal to 4.3 cm. Vernier coincidence VC is equal to 8. Total reading TR, R4 is equal to MSR plus VC into LC is equal to 4.38 centimeters.